Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Life at SAP. So today in this session, I'm going to explain how to upload the master data with the help of Fury app, migrate your data. So SAP has provided this migrate your data from SAP S4 HANA 2020 version onwards. So with the help of this Fury app, we can upload the, all the master data like uh, jail master data, cost center master data and profit center master data. So in this section, I will going to explain how to how to create an object for uh, uploading the master data, and in that we have almost six steps. I will go by each step and I explain what we have to do to complete uh, to successfully complete the master data upload. So let's get started. So uh, first of all, we have to access the Fury for Fury for this, and I'm going to enter the Fury app in the command field. So that is a slash n slash ui2 slash flp and hit enter the system will uh, open your browser and take you to the uh, so the system will take you to the uh, fury home screen so here i have already created the uh, open this in my chrome so here we can see this one this is a fury home home page and here we need to select this search icon and and we have to enter the Fury app name. So I'm going to enter the migrate your data. So yeah, this is the one migrate your data. Select this Fury app. And now here, when I have opened this one, system is showing that no data found. So uh, in this system, no project has been created. So I'm going to create. I'm going to select this create option. And here we have two options migrate data using staging tables. If you are going to create the master data in the same uh, uh, table, same system, then we have to select this option. I'm going to select this option here. So, and here system, uh, we have to up, uh, we have to give the name for a project. I'm going to upload uh, in this section. We are going to upload this cost center master data. So I'm giving the name as cost center master data. yeah so here then the database connections uh, we have to select this local sap s4 hana database schema and i'm selecting i'm going to the step two here we have uh, all the master data objects we need to select the cost i need to select the cost center one so i'm selecting here the cost center one and i'm clicking on this arrow here and then click on review view yeah system is saying a uh, particular object exists for this selection do you want add this no do not add this one yeah uh, and then click on project here so we have successfully created the project and then we need to select this project and click on this arrow and and system will show you this screen and here we have uh, we have totally six steps uh, system will it will take a two to three seconds to update the screen here. System will enable us and show us the uh, fields here. Just a second. Yep. Yeah. So uh, we have here total six steps here. So we need to go one by one. So the first step is download template. Uh, so we are going to download this template, the Excel file, and we need to feed the data which we are going to upload in the Excel file. Then once the template file is ready, we are we have we are going to select this upload file and uh, we need to upload that Excel file. Then system will check all this mapping within this uh, in this uh, step, and then followed by simulation step in this simulation step no uh, system will check uh, if we have any errors uh, it will show those all errors here if all are successful then uh, it will show the count here so if all are successful then we can go ahead and uh, click on select the migration if when we select the migration system will create those entries in the sap system so i'm selecting this download template option here then automatically system will uh, download this template here i'm saving on the my desktop and then yeah so here is the template file so in this template file we have we can see three tabs here uh, this uh, introduction tab uh, 
In this introduction tab, we can see all the introduction relating to this migration copy template and file. How do we have to upload step by step? Uh, it has uh, in this in this uh, tab, and then coming to this uh, field list, field list tab. So here we can see. Uh, all the fields which we are going to upload the master data so basically i'm uploading this call center master data so we can see here all the fields which we will be having in the uh, uh, while while we are creating the call center master data so i will show you here in the transaction case 01 or case 03 so i'm selecting this one of the call center so we can see all these uh, fields uh, in this excel template file and here uh, in the last uh, call center master data record so here we have to feed the data which we are going to upload so i'm uh, i have already entered the data so th so my controlling area is 2000 and my call centers are this one to uh, 002 underscore 20 from 40 to 26 we are going to create these seven uh, call centers and uh, i have also provided this all the basic information like a valid from and to and currency yeah we have uh, other fields also here yeah, language and call center name and description and responsible person and uh, hierarchy area company code and currency and profit center and now uh, this file template file is ready and now i'm going to upload this file in a uh, fury app so yep so i'm going back to fury yeah so i'm selecting uh, i'm selecting the second option upload file so here we can see this upload option select this option and select your file and click on open system will take a few seconds uh, to to upload this uh, data into our uh, staging tables then system will show us the successfully uploaded into staging table message yep we can see here data successfully transferred into staging tables then go one step back here and then select the uh, second task third task i mean prepare and system will uh, start the preparation started uh, it will take a few seconds to complete this preparation task then meanwhile you can select this mapping task yep uh, click on refresh display here oh. uh, system is showing only for controlling area to be mapped uh, just click on to be mapped and give your com uh, controlling area here and con click on confirm here and go one step back here yep and then select all these uh, fields and click on confirm click on ok here then click on refresh display again okay. yeah we can see here all the eight fields we have uh, it's confirmed the mapping has been confirmed and then go one step back and select the simulation task if you have any errors uh, then system will show that uh, those errors and successful records here if you have uh, any errors we have to go back to our file and we need to check what are those errors and we can check with the help of this monitor option so uh, we don't have any errors and the system is showing all the all those records are successful here and now i'm going to select this migrate option whenever i select this option no system will upload those all the master data in uh, s4 system yeah i'm selecting this option here so uh, system is throwing a warning message saying that you are going to migrate the data the migration cannot be under are you sure want to continue yes click on ok yeah if you have any errors system will show you in this field level error successful not started currently it's uh, showing as a not started yep uh we don't have any errors and the scholar successful records we can see here seven migration progress 100 percent completed so now I will go back to SAP and use the transaction code SE16N and table cost center master data table CSKS. Then we'll check this all those records. I'm going back to this SAP system and step back here. Enter the transaction code SE16N and give the table name. 
CS case hit enter and give your controlling area thousand and cost center and zero zero two scroll twenty and from twenty to fifty six yeah sixty second Ready fix and then give our company code. Company code here. Yeah. Then click on execute. Yeah. Here we can see all those records. All those seven records successfully we have created. And I'm going back to this Excel file again. Yeah, here we can see these all records. The cost centers are from 2002 underscore 20 to 26. We can see the same records here. So, hope you guys understand uh, about this process of uh, how to create the my uh, how to create the master data in the help of my create your data fury app. Yeah, thanks to everyone. Thanks for watching this video.